everybody, this is Walters954 here on the journey to teach myself Python. So we're right at the beginning. If you don't know what Python is, it's a programming language that you use to make applications and uh, different web services and things like that. Anything that deals with a computer, basically, you can uh, make it through Python. So um, go ahead and do your download. If you haven't already downloaded the latest version, then I would recommend that you download Python. Uh, it's a free IDE that you can get or else you'll be stuck with the regular command prompt one which command prompt one is good for the beginning learning so you can do the original hello world oops hello world and print it out but the PyCharm IDE is a lot more uh, friendly I guess you could say so um, the reason I kinda wanna do this is because data science is a field that's very interesting to me and a lot of the things that they do in data science are run through Python so at least getting a, a leg up by learning this and teaching myself it right now so um, I have PyCharm loaded up here and you already have uh, you name the package whatever you want just uh, created a folder so right click on here new folder or directory directories are same thing as folders directory YouTube tutorials and then I created a new Python file named it whatever and you can do that py that's an extension for python but you shouldn't have to do it because it should do it automatically for you so we're here at the beginning and I'll, i guess i'll do a little bit of describing myself so name equal to my walters so you almost hear me refer to myself so walters 944 and um, we'll do print name. So Python is, uh, the variable declarations don't really matter. It'll do it automatically for you. The, I'm pretty sure all of the objects are, all of the variables are objects. So it just kind of in, it infers what type of variables that you're using. So this is automatically gonna be a string. And um, if you put a number on here, num equals one, two, three, I'm gonna print num. It's automatically, it's going to print the same thing out with, with, as text, but it's automatically going to know that this is an integer. And it's the same thing if you do, so I'll change this to int, double, string, so that we can kind of go over all the variable names. Oops. Print out integer here. I keep messing up. The integer there, and then we're going to print double. And so, let's see if we so do it here. So you can uh, right click and hit run, and that will automatically run it down here in the, the console. But once it's run once in the console, then you have this uh, little quick bar menu over here. So you can uh, press shift F10 to run it, or you can um, just press the little plus sign, which is what I'll, uh, or the, the go arrow, which is what I'll normally do most of the time. So, um, yep, we have this. Um, so that's the beginning, just going over the strings and integers. If you're watching these, I'm, I'm hoping that, you know, you've already done a little bit of background on programming because I'm not going to go over some of the simple things that I already know. I just kind of want to learn the syntax of the language and go forward with the different types of packages and um, the different things that they can do like scripting and things like that. So this one, I'm just going to go over the, the basic stuff of the strings. But there's all the regular primitive types and then you can do if statements like if double equals equals one colon so now there has to be four spaces in between here or the id automatically puts these spaces in here so we're going to print double plus two and um and so we're going to run this i have a syntax error somewhere so let's see what's going on integer on line two I took this out for some reason. So let's do one, two, three here. 
and uh, yeah, double plus two double was one over here. So, yep. So we have that done. Um, this is just the beginning of simple things. On the next tutorial, we'll probably go through like for loops and things like that. But um, I'll put a link to everything in the description below, and you guys make sure to leave comments. Probably gonna be running through the learnpython.org um, things pretty quickly. Variable types run through all of these in the advanced tutorials in the next couple of videos and then um, see where it goes from there where you have a couple ideas of things that I need to work on so this is going to be a lot of uh, me just figuring out how this programming language actually works and why people love it so much so thanks for watching and uh, keep a lookout for the next video